What's up guys, my name is Lance. I'm the filmer for the Braille channel, but I've been learning how to skateboard. The trick that I picked for today is the fakey big spin. So it looks like the first steps are to get your fakey ollies down and your half cabs down. Both of those I can do. Half cabs need a little improvement, so I'm gonna practice those right now. Fakey ollie. Ish. Almost. Okay, I'll do one more of those. Okay, so that's the fakie ollie. So now for the half cab. The problem I have with half cabs is just fully committing. So I'm gonna keep my back foot on no matter what. First try. Not bad, not bad. Okay, so those are the two basic tricks. I was going over this with Gabe beforehand and it does seem like there is a practice step which is just doing it one footed. So I'm gonna go ahead and do some of those before I jump into trying the whole trick. So that kind of helps you get the idea of how to form the trick. Almost, it's just not quite rotating all the way around. Okay, so that's pretty good. So now I'm just gonna go for it. It's just really about commitment because I can do it with forming it with my front foot. So just like the half cab, I just gotta keep my back foot on no matter what. So here we go. That was, that was the closest. My back foot was just a little bit off of it. <laughs> that was bad. See, in my head, I'm still scared, to be honest. Like, I'm just thinking, what is gonna happen with this board? I'm gonna land on it. It's gonna be a weird position. I'm gonna slip out, but it doesn't really make sense. Okay, so Gabe keeps, keeps telling me that I got it, so. Just makes me think I'm just not committing, so I really just gotta commit. Super close. Really close. I just have to get my back foot on there. I've got that one footed down well. Oh. The only thing that I'm changing is I'm just gonna jump a little bit more forward so I'm there when the board's there. There it was. Super close. I'm getting the mechanics of the trick now. By jumping more forward, my feet are there. Still some definite fear factor. I don't trust what's gonna happen on the other side, so I just don't commit, I kick away. So, can't do that. Oh my God. All I'm telling myself right now in my head is just do it. Who cares what happens to your body? Land the damn trick. That was it. I didn't commit. That was so it. Oh. Oh. It's so much similar to when I was learning half cabs. Like, it took me so many tries to just get my back foot on there. Oh. Two to make it true. I figured it out, so we're doing two to make it true. Normally I don't do two to make it true. Oh. Yeah. Woo! Three to make it a tree. Yes. Okay, I'll do the last one. 
but not all the way around. We're gonna do another one. Woo! Yeah! Yes! What was that, five, four, five? Oh my gosh, that was a cool trick. It was like, felt impossible. I was like, God, that, you know, it looks easy, but then I try it, I'm like, no way. But I kept doing it and doing it. I got more comfortable, less fearful. I got that trick pretty good. I have to keep practicing it to really get it solid, but I think a lot of you guys, I've been reading in the comments and you say, Lance, I don't know if you know this, but you're very inspiring. Well, I just, I think that means a lot. I don't always think with that, but it's true though. If I can learn these tricks, you guys can learn them just like I can. And I learned them by taking Aaron's advice in the Skateboarding Made Simple series and on his tutorials on the channel. So get Skateboarding Made Simple, watch the tutorials on the channel, keep watching our videos, keep liking the videos, subscribe to the channel, comment. It all helps so much and it means a lot to us. Thank you guys. <laughs>